Your buddy Brian back here with a look at Myro. All right, we have lost this support down here in the bottom. We talked about this in the last video. I did it about a week ago here. All right, we were talking that if this was the Wave 5, uh, about a bottom in there. Looks like the Wave 5 is coming in here. Uh, we're going to cover this in just a second. Look for a bottom here and uh, see if we can get a bounce and, and get a retracement. Okay, that's what we're mainly looking for here out of this thing is to uh, is to start back up the other side, right? Let's go over here real fast. Take a look here at uh, Bitcoin. All right, that thing tells uh, a lot of the story here with the whole market. A lot of news going on out there with you know possibly Biden dropping out of the presidential running. Just a lot of stuff going on that uh, you know news can play a big part in, uh, in price action. Wasn't really expecting this uh, this last push down here yesterday. Let's go on a four hour here. I just did a members video on. Uh, uh, short time frame scalping uh, if you're a member uh, go check that out man I love trading short time frames uh, like five minute three minute uh, with moving averages um, go over and check that out you know it's a pretty decent video I put together there if you if you get the hang of it uh, you can just do really well you know with short term uh, trading uh, with the with the moving averages all right um, now if you're interested in joining up for that it's only 15 bucks guys you get 23 videos over nine hours maybe 10 hours of videos I haven't counted for sure and a link to the discord uh, to come over there and start trading with us we are using a new trading site I will link it in the description of the video uh, we've had a bunch of people going over there um, no KYC uh, a lot of people were looking for that after Maxi went to that. Um, I don't blame people. I don't want my information out there either. You know what I mean? With uh, uh, all the hacking and stuff like that going on. So um, I just want to keep all that stuff private. I pay my taxes and take care of all that. But I don't want to put my information on a site uh, that, you know, that you never know. Okay, so there's a link in the description of the video if you want to go over there and sign up with us. Use the link, you get special discounts for the group, and uh, and, and come join us, man. We'd love to have you. And so let's take a look here. Uh, Bitcoin ended up here. You can clearly see this thing one, two, three, four, five. All right, is this fifth wave done yet? That's the, that's the question. Okay, it could have a little bit that more down. Uh, the measured move for this thing is right down there, about 55,100. Okay, is this a good enough push here? Could be, you know, you know the RSIs on Bitcoin are, are heading back to the upside. You got bullish divergences going on in here all over the place. The four hour, you got bullish divergence. The eight hour down here in the bottom, let me show you. So you got this low and you got a higher low. Uh, and on price action, you got this low and a lower low. So you got bullish divergence there on the eight. On the 12, you don't have bullish divergence, all right? But uh, the 12 hour is almost reset. And on the daily, you're very, very close to bullish divergence on the daily. You can see it right in here. Right? You got this low. And if this low holds upwards at, you will have bullish divergence there on the daily. All right, right there. It could, it could even fall more and still have bullish divergence on it. But that's what we're looking for in here. One, two, three, four, five. You know, five waves down and, uh, and a bottom here for Bitcoin. Uh, that the daily is, is rolling over a little bit here. But you can see how oversold it is down at the bottom here. It's super, super oversold. Pretty low, okay? Uh, the three day uh, is bullish and the five day and you got bullish divergence on the three day the five day uh, is also uh, reset and bullish so looking for that fifth, uh, fifth wave up here in Bitcoin don't know if that's the end or not you know we'll have to wait and see here but that would give us uh, we come out on a monthly chart and look at this thing you know you, chart wise you know every guy out there that charts will should tell you that uh, you should have a fifth wave coming up here It'd be one two three four and five all right now the trend based Fibonacci gives a target around 85,000 uh, if you take your regular if it comes down here to 55 
Look at that, how that lines up, right up to 85 also. So you got the uh, confluence there with them two. All right, now this, uh, we'll see what happens here. For the first time, Bitcoin on the daily has come down and touched that 200 day moving average. All right, now in the other bull runs here, back in 2021, it didn't touch that area. Uh, you know, this first whole run up here didn't even come close. You know, right here in 2021, you had this massive run up here. Uh, it stayed way far away from it. This technically was the top. Everything and all the indicators indicate that uh, you did cross below it here, but then uh, the very last time that was it. Uh, you know, you had the death cross in here, the 50 and the 200 cross, and that was it. You had a death cross in here too, but um, you know, so we're keeping a close eye on this thing. Uh, see if it can regain that 200-day uh, moving average. It's just below it right now. You can see it right on the daily. Just fighting to keep a hold of it. A break of this white resistance line right here. You know, and we should be starting that fifth wave up towards that 85. Now, if we go back over here to my row. Kind of got that same thing going on. Five waves down in here. All right. You got right here. You have one, two three four and a fifth wave here okay let's measure this fifth wave out and see if it's about over with and then take a look at some RSI's and see if they are uh, pointing to the upside or not okay go right from there to there nine two all right if it goes the whole way down where are we at in one hour let's take a look one hour RSI is heading down okay so uh, could get that final push down here um, down to 92 whoops geez sorry about that darn it let's put that back all right that would be down uh, yeah to 92 all right so maybe we get that the four hour uh, is 11 4 and 10 8 uh, technically bullish but showing weakness there all right, it's showing a weakness. I would uh, let's put this back where it belongs. Right about there. Okay, let's lock it in place. Uh, the eight hour, uh, right at the very bottom, and it is bullish. Uh, Twelve hour, right about at the bottom, and uh, zero and eleven, it is almost reset. Okay, and your daily. Uh, the daily is heading that. Look how oversold it is way down at the bottom it's a minus 218 down here on the bottom very very oversold where's the three day uh, your three day the three day and the five day should be about reset yeah the three day is reset uh, what do we got here is that bearish divergence here no we had a lower high we got high and a lower high all right and the five day and the five days reset okay so getting close to a bottom here I believe um, keep an eye on that right around that 9-2 I think that's gonna be a bottom and this thing should get a bounce all right um, now the big thing is gonna be busting back into that uh, resistance area up here 9293 somewhere right around there you know and zoomed straight in but I'd be watching for it right down here oops oh, that's good news I'm gonna cast a long there on a scalp just the video I just did on scalping so um, yeah go sign man sports 15 bucks dude I'm telling you go sign up for that and uh, you'll get your $15 out of it just out of knowledge and trading it's it's well worth it all right now the big question is when my if my road gets the bounce right here we're gonna put a line here for a bottom that's what we're looking for right around here for a bounce all right are we going to be able to get back up in here all right it's going to work its way back up here the question is is it going to get back into where we need it to get in okay uh, let's come out on a daily chart you know and we'll be looking for retracements out of this thing retracement levels all right if we start a bottom here we should start five waves up all right that's uh with in bitcoin uh, with Bitcoin running a fifth wave, that's when the altcoins are gonna run. Okay, that's when we're expecting uh, the big the big moves out of all the altcoins in Bitcoin's fifth wave. That's where we should have our alt season. All right, so 
but we're looking for uh, you know retracement back up to 23 to 25 cents that would be the first targets all right so that's the first targets we need to get up to so hopefully we can bust back up in here first we need to wait for this bottom to come in and then we'll shoot for these targets all right thank you so much guys uh go over in the description of the video sign up for that new uh that new site over there we're using for trading uh, it's a great site and uh sign up for a level three membership we'd love to have you have a great day everybody